we're here at the we're here at the Cookie Canucks. Is that even a thing? Is it weird when you is it weird when you say the in front of it? That's only that's all the people that have done it. That's not very many. No, it's not very many. Is it a lot of them? People try the twelve pounder. Legit, one hundred percent cucumber challenge. All right. No, I don't want I don't want onion or pickles. Oh, gosh. You're gonna get you with it now? No, I just don't like onions and pickles. Yeah, yeah. The I'm a, I'm a burger guy. I mean, I'm not gonna be successful. I know that. Bro, so you zero chance. Fries too. No way. Zero chance. So in today's episode, we're gonna be talking about getting past your past. That's right, guys. Believe it or not. <laughs> Believe it. <laughs> we're talking about surrendering. Okay. <laughs> Intro. No, I, I wasn't saying anything. You no, were... look at the camera, not me. <laughs> you ever get in your own way, Lauren? Every once in a while. Okay. Not that often, though. No, no, you're pretty good. Identity theft is not a joke, Jim. What obstacle are we about ready to face here? Cucamonga challenge. The big four-pound burger. Can we four eat it within an burger. hour? Let the games begin! I was talking about earlier, I used to hit the burger at Harvest Foods. It was a half-pound burger. This is eight of those. You have a YouTube channel? You're like, what's this math video doing here? Sometimes it might seem like you're making progress in life, like you're really getting somewhere, you're really going after it, but it's like we keep getting these reminders of our past. Here we go, off to Cornerstone. You have facial hair now. Can we zoom in on this? Everything. Look at that hair. Would you look at that? It's like the enemy wants to constantly bring up all of our past and specifically our mistakes. I don't know, sometimes it just feels like you just can't get on to the next thing God has for you because you're constantly reminded of your past. One of the hardest things that we got to get past is our past. You think you might be the only person that deals with it, but we're not. I mean, everybody struggles with that. It's, it's, as, as I say, if you're like, oh yeah, that's me. Multiple people are saying that because we, we all kind of struggle with that. Isn't it the difference between what you guys have been talking about? This is the difference between living in the tree of life or out of the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. Is that the right episode? My man watching the episode. Hey! <laughs> Still talking about the tree of life. You know where there are no trees? In a football stadium. Have you ever noticed there's people that they'll tend to struggle with the same thing over and over and over again, and it's almost like they have to ask for forgiveness all the time, repeatedly. There's actually a lot of scripture that has to deal with that specific. Psalm 103, 10 through 11. He doesn't treat us as our sins deserve, nor pay us back in full for our wrongs. As high as the heaven is over the earth, so strong is his love to those who fear him. That is how far God's willing to go to forgive us, so why can't we just forgive ourselves? So you gotta ask yourself, am I constantly reminding myself of my past failures? God, we ask you to forgive us for the sin in our lives. Please forgive us of our attitudes, the anger we have, lying or cheating, so many different sins that try to hold us back. But we know how much you love us and forgive us. Please help us to forgive ourselves so we can surrender ourselves completely to you. In Jesus' name, amen. We have four Cucamonga challenges in the house. Give it up for the boys! Hey. They've got 60 minutes in which to eat 12,387 calories. Ready, set, go! Let's go, boys! Cancelled today due to lack of hustle. Deal with it. I got the gluten free side. They stuck all the gluten on one side. I didn't want to overdo it. I got to drive home. Uh, probably about a quarter. Yeah, about a quarter of the way through the burger, but I did finish a lot of the fries. Look at that. A lot of the fries. 